Lovely, it was nice. My plants. Right, so yeah, these are all sort of these are all the kind of tracks I was kind of talking about where you get somewhere and it, sometimes they're marked as a white track. Could be a private road, might not be. Sometimes they're little B road, and this is ultra B road. And sometimes um, it, it turns out that they have got a footpath overlaid on them, but it's still a road. But then when you get to it, it's actually not a road at all. It's turned into a bridleway. So this is like one of those things. So I'll just be respectful here. Don't want to spook any horses, especially she's. Uh, this one looks like she's on her own. This is nice, isn't it? Jesus. Okay, so it's not byways, it's not off-road, but do you know what? There's some really nice tracks here today. Again, slowly, slowly, catchy monkey here. Oh, left or right, I don't know which way to go, really. Do you know what? I might just double back and go through that bit. I've just... Because that looks all right. Or should I? I'll oh, sod it. It's hard to know which route is the best one to take. I'll just keep on this one. There we go. So my spidey sense is saying that I'm somewhere a little bit in the general vicinity of somewhere or other. Uh, but really, if I had to kind of pinpoint where I was, if I didn't have the, you know, the mapping, uh, I'm trying to say, um, you know, I think I'd be a little bit lost here, so I'd be looking for a sign at some point. Um, but, yeah, look at this place. This is nice. I've been, you know what, I, I've never driven on these roads, but, or sort of ridden on these roads, but, um, there's a, something very, very familiar about them. There's something very familiar. Just nice, nice, I love it. Yeah. This is where you, you know, you're riding around, you find, you find peace, really. You just find peace in what you're doing and, you know. Do all want to be stuck indoors? You know, when I can be out and about doing this. You know, getting out in the countryside, getting nature and, and seeing this stuff, you know, and people think, oh, well, it's just a bunch of freaking trees. I don't know, I don't know what it is. It's just, it's better to be outside and doing stuff, you know, in all sorts of weathers, that is, you know. I'm, I, obviously, it's, it's nicer, it's better, I suppose, nicer when it's dry. Um, but, you know, as long as it's dry and it's not pissing down with rain, but even that, you know, you can still get out and have fun. You just gotta, uh, just sorry, just check, saw another byway or restricted byway, but it was, I think it was more like a, a bridleway that was blocked off to traffic. Had a gate across it, so I think there is vehicle access, but that's purely for, you know, whoever owns the land, I would have thought, you know, unsuitable for motor vehicles. So what's that one then? Because that's not saying, Okay, that's interesting, because that's not saying it's uh It's a byway. Do you know, that's interesting. I think that's alright. See, that's this is a, a classic case in point. This is just a, a normal track. You know, I'm going to go and I'm going to go and investigate that one. Let me just see. Because it says, but it doesn't say that's just information only. It doesn't say that you're not allowed to. Give it a go, give it a go. And I know it's a very, this is just a short bit here. So I'm going to have to bear with me because I'm going to have to 
change some settings to off-road, try and control that traction control. That was one of the big problems I had yesterday actually. Adjusting the suspension. Hey, there we go. It's not really clear. Right, here we go. So, just taking it nearly easy, and this is off roading. Nice, nice. Oh, I like this one. Yeah, this is alright. So, I'm just going slowly up here. Uh, I'm just going to let it roll up the hill see if I can keep it rolling because this is where you know and it's, it has been quite dry see that's a bit of front wheel action there there we go now I'm just coming to the middle really because let me go to the rut side again this was the problem I had yesterday. I had the front wheel slipping out completely. I was off camber and the back wheel just completely went for me. And then couldn't get there again. And because, you know, it's just because of the road tyres. You know. But actually, this soil, compared to yes, this is quite a. It's not a sandy soil, it's a loamy soil. So it's just. Um, it's just a little bit drier when you're riding on it, if you know what I mean. Now I'm caught in this rut here, and I don't want to come out of it. And you think, well, it's not a big rut. The problem is, if I try and come out of this, my front wheel, so I'll show you now. So the front wheel, yeah, it's just, let's come out of there, let's come into the middle of it. That's because the back wheel just completely went at 45 degrees there. There we go. Let's just stay on the top bit. See how we go. Just going really, really slowly. And see what it says. This is nice. Yeah. There we go. Bit of confidence now. There we go, coming off it. This is nice, I like that one. Short and sweet. Yeah, but again, it's just a track, it's marked track, it's a marked yellow track. That's not a marked, um, not a white track or a byway or a restricted byway or anything. A track. So, there you go. Interesting, eh? Right. Keep on going. Now I'll come up here. And this is where I've got another track to come. There's a left turn very, very soon. Okay, hold on a minute. That was uh, to bridle way. That's a bridle now. Oh, free. Okay. All right. So that bit's a bright bay, the other bit wasn't. How very odd. Okay, so just going to carry on down here, down to uh, down through the trees. I mean, you can see. I mean, okay, it's not as bad as the proper off-road track, but you know, it's still something to behold. I mean, crikey, I can't really. Amazing, amazing. Just yeah, look, front wheel really, really just slipped out there. Bloody hell. 